Hey, what's up guys? Have you ever wondered what happens when a farming guild goes to war? Well, in today's video, this is what you're gonna see. So CDC is really mostly a farmer's guild, but it was wow time and we decided to go. I put four of my five accounts in fury for this. So in today's video, you're gonna see what happened when CDC went to war against the RR Guild, which has been uh, basically uh, dominating this kingdom for the last several weeks. So as it starts, I'm looking around to see what's happening. Uh, we have one rally lead in the chat being um, at the moment silent, so we don't have any uh, guidelines as to what to do. We see that Riku is sending something. Riku is not that strong though. And as I click on the fort to see what he sent, I notice he has a range blast and he gets knocked out. There's no walk back. And I'm like, oh, did he get cap? And as I go and I watch uh, Royal Jace Castle, I notice he got cap. So obviously, guys, you got to be careful. You got to know what you're doing. And as I'm looking at what Riku has, uh, we're going to see his castle. And oh, no, but we see that Sir Killer, their big player is tp next to him he's about to set and riku tps away uh a couple minutes later uh i'm looking at this and i see riku is next to a wonder it's a little yeah and then prof baxton so that does not look very serious it looks like it's a one troop there it is just one troop so i at this point i'm still waiting for guidelines what do we need to do there's no one that has taken a fort seriously it's all one troops it looks like the guys are playing kvk but it's not kvk it's wow uh so i'm looking around waiting for guidelines so we're gonna jump forward a little bit and at this point um at this point i'm looking over all the forts wr and as i'm looking circular has set a rally on riku riku does not have his leader as you guys can see um he has a he has a prisoner uh it is one of his outs uh, riku has this type of gear really on a mix set when you have blasts like a drum and a vial this is not good riku has much to learn about this game we jump a little forward in time and as you can see my accounts are all joined in a rally moose our rally lead as set on on one of the wonders but we're gonna go watch re uh, the rally on riku obviously uh, he does not have his leader he has a prisoner one of his alt um and we're gonna move forward a little bit as they start walking on them uh 30 minutes it looks like they're not uh speeding it up and as i'm about to click we see that they start to carpet he currently has 200,000 reinf he did not ask for anything we see someone that is about to uh, reinf him but sadly he gets burned out um we don't have the reports for that but yeah it was not <laughs> uh definitely without his leader probably doesn't have a lot of troops uh that was that was bad uh, and we're about to walk and people are walking past the deadline guys please please use your boots for that uh don't be cheap uh we're uh walking a little bit late and we're gonna uh, we're gonna see that moose 25 are a big rally lead uh, walking and there we go we're walking cutting a little bit uh let's look at moose he has a five uh piece champ account we're gonna go see what happens when he hits the fort against local 58 and we knock them out there we go it was very close 50,000 troop difference uh range phalanx against in phalanx uh, I believe they have like a 111. Uh, Local 58 is a decent account, right? Four piece champ uh, with uh, 12 astralite on the winter mitts. Very strong account. We go again on another fort, this time Bright Fort. We left the other fort to RR and we're walking Moose and he's knocking out another fort of rr it's going great <laughs> are we gonna keep it up and as you can see guys this one is a little bit we have like a hundred thousand more troop difference uh range phalanx against range phalanx i believe they own they once again send it like a one 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 type of composition and uh 
and we see that Royal J is a four piece champ, very strong account. So this is pretty much on par at this point. We have not, um, and as we are reinforcing, uh, basically I'm looking at, and I'm looking at, oh, no commander, what happened? Lack of communication, guys. We left the wonder while the relief was walking. The kinder is the relief. You guys need to better communicate when this happens. And he's still walking, still walking. It, we're gonna be able to uh, reinf the um, the wonder, and we jump forward. A royal G is going against the kinder, and we're gonna go see the kinder's set, and you're gonna see some mistakes, guys. Gargantua belt and a fear drum on on this kind of set is not great. Uh, the kinder probably should uh, not take that hit and Royal J is walking and as I'm watching his profile with four piece champ. They speed up and they knock us away and it's a massacre. 1.6 million difference. The kinder does not have any business holding a fourth. We're gonna move forward to Moose going again on Frozen Ford this time. And what's gonna happen? Oh, it's a loss. And it's a big loss. It's a big loss. We lost by 600,000 troops. Mitch Ito, 1.1 billion might. He is the R5 of Raiders Kill Razors. Very strong account. Only one uh, champ piece, but that does not tell the old story. Very strong old by Mitch Ito. And at this point, we've won two and we've lost two very badly. And it was 424 for us against 686, uh, this kind of variant. So uh, they definitely won that round. The last two rounds was a massacre. And finally, we take the base. They have all the forts and Circular is running a rally. Very strong count, 164. He's like a Titan um, kind of account. And he's gonna walk, and let's look at this seven piece, very strong account with, and, and while I'm looking at it, they carpet, and they knock us out, and let's look at that report, you guys, you'll see, it is, it is not pretty to watch, let's look at this. Basically 800,000 troop difference and they, they did a black wing against us. Oh boy, 424 against 424, same failings. They really showed us who were the boss. They had more T5, but definitely stronger guys. They knew what they were doing. I'm guessing they had a lot more sigils than we did. We had about 30, 40%, something like that. Moose did a good job overall, but at the end of the day, RR won the day. They were stronger, guys. If you like this kind of videos, we're going to do more in the future. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you later.